Hi, this is Tom Contos, and welcome to the May Contos Commentary. Well, I'm really excited to be able to present this commentary to you from my favorite room in the house, a drum studio. And a drum roll might be appropriate in describing the way May prices shot back up after significant declines in March and April. When looked at on an aggregated basis, wholesale used vehicle prices in May appeared to more than make up for losses in March and April, resulting from the COVID-19 pandemic. However, with the remarketing industry having undergone significant changes in sales volumes and composition, aggregated numbers often mask lingering weakness in wholesale prices relative to pre-COVID levels that are revealed when disaggregating the data by sale type, model year, model class, etc. Auctions are selling proportionately more younger, lower mileage, higher dollar units in better condition, with more sales coming from commercial consigners than dealer consigners, including more factory and captive finance sales. This richer mix of vehicles is biasing average prices upward. Plus, sales volumes in May were still below year ago and pre-COVID levels. So we're really looking at a market that is a more restricted market than the total market conditions would be if we were at full output. Nevertheless, Wholesale prices in May did experience a significant rebound and represented a healthy balance between offered supply and dealer demand. And these continued into June uh, and we'll have full results for June in a couple of weeks. We'll share those with you too, but we think the same trend that we were seeing in May will continue into June. We caution you to think about volumes then and of supply that may be coming back in the months to come but uh, in the meantime let's enjoy this positive market uh, while it lasts we'll look forward to seeing you next time in the meantime be safe be well and thanks for your attention